We're at the University of Birmingham, where basketball is the latest monster challenge. It's a goalkeeper's special, and with the boys 2-0 down, their hopes are pinned on Darren Randolph. While Jessica Myers will be looking to extend the lead for the ladies. The pressure was on, with both players revealing past experience on the court. Uh, I don't know, I used to play a little bit when I was younger. Um, I play a little bit in the summertime when I got home in the off season. So uh, it would be good to get back out and throw up a few shots again today. I used to play at school. <laughs> I used to play at school and got selected for regional trials. Got through them, then got selected for England trials, which I then unfortunately had to turn down for football. It is, I need to bring a bit of respect back and uh, get the boys on the, on the board and uh, set up nicely for the next, ta uh, next task. He was hoping for someone that wasn't going to play basketball, so I'm hoping maybe a bit of a disadvantage for him, but we'll see. Got to bring the girls into the lead. Both players will have three shots from five different positions on the court. The winner will be the person who racks up the most points. At first from the two-point line is Jessica for the girls. Jessica storms into a 4-2 lead after round one and is first up from the top of the key where every basket is worth three points. See how I just sucked through and gave a bit of confidence after the first one. After 100% accuracy, Randolph gave the boys a commanding 11-4 lead, heading into round three. I'm trying to take this money like this. Randolph heat pressure on his opponent extending his lead to 14-4 with just two rounds remaining. Jess failed to claw any points back, leaving Randolph with the task of making the scoreline emphatic. Both players failed to find the net from the halfway line, meaning the final scores were Randolph 20 and Myers 4. Oh, man. brought a bit of respect back. Feels good. Get, uh, get one on the board um, in the game. I think that suited me. See how I sucked her in, gave a bit of confidence at the start, and then just blew her away. What you say about that initial start after round one, Jess led 4 2. Was that a ploy? No, I was actually just a bit nervous. She put me under pressure by getting the first two, <laughs> and then I put myself under pressure. But lucky enough, I was able to get it back on the three pointers. Disappointed, but I guess it's how it goes. But good start, which makes it harder for puts you, more, puts you under more pressure for the other rounds. Fortunately, we've lost one game now, so whoever's up next has got to do a good job. No pressure. So Darren Randolph brings the boys back into the contest. And as always, if you want to suggest the next task, then tweet at bcfc.com using the hashtag MonsterChallenge.